Hello YouTube, how's everybody? This is Bob, and here's my uh, 2020 uh, RAV4, Toyota RAV4. About a month ago, I showed you how I made a, a sleeping platform for this car, which is level, so I can uh, car camp overnight in this car. And uh, the one I showed you was using a ready-made tabletop. Sorry for my messy garage. Uh, here's the tabletop right there. I cut the leg short and cut the leg off right here for the front and that's for the back. And it, it worked pretty well. Uh, and on top of the table, I put this plank, which is uh, 75 by uh, 27 inches on top of the table, which is uh, works as a frame. And it worked pretty well. Uh, it was comfortable and it was flat. However, because this is a little stick right there. This is too little too thick. Cut down the headroom. So I like to have a little bit more headroom when I sleep. So I'm going to instead of using this, I'm just going to place this uh, plank right right on the in the in the bed of the uh, SUV. But I'm going to have to raise the back up a little bit. Let me show you. Here's the uh, back of my uh, SUV. You see, uh, with the rear seat folded down, it's not flat because this is flat right here. This part is flat, but that seat uh, inclines up about six and a half inches. So what I need to do is I need to uh, I need to put the plank right there this way, and then uh, put legs in the back rear to prop it up. And I got these uh, six inch table top table legs my driveway is not exactly flat this so it will raise up the plank about six inches enough to also to put this uh, storage bin under and then make a flat sleeping surface because I have this wheel well right here kind of bulging out I'm gonna have a cut cut a section off of the platform to accommodate so let's get to it got these uh, four inch ready-made table legs from uh, home depot and got these four uh, threaded inserts these are called ever built from uh, home depot now these legs are a little bit more ornate than i like to these are six inches tall but because of octagonal shape or near circular shape, it gives the best contact area to the tabletop. So should be better than the, than the square ones. Here it is, completed. I just need two, but two legs. It's flat. I have to cut, I'm gonna cut a little bit more off here. And maybe be more off there. It'll be perfect. And uh, I still can have a uh, storage here. So you can have storage underneath. This still looks a little slanted because my driveway is slanted. My driveway is slanted. But it should be pretty fat. See? It's very sturdy, extremely sturdy. I'm uh, 195 pounds, five feet, 10 inches, and this will accommodate me perfectly. This plank is uh, 75 inches by uh, 27 inches. That's uh, six foot three, more than enough for me. Here it is with my uh, single person mattress in, trifold mattress, my solar light, it's very nice. This is how it looks. Somebody can still sit on this chair and this chair can even uh, lean forward. So, and one can get into the bed real easily because there's plenty of headroom. There's plenty of headroom. Let 
This is how it looks from this side. Nice. Can't wait to go camping again. Looks very nice. Looks like a hotel room. Now that's comfortable. Oh, good night. <laughs> Thank you for watching.